the hardest question I could find for circle theorems. Now this one looks pretty awful. As soon as you see a circle that has a load of letters instead of angles, you know it's going to be a difficult one. But I'm going to show you this isn't as bad as it first seems. So we have to prove that a equals x plus y minus 90. Realistically, there are several ways this can be done. So my best advice is just try and work out as many angles as you can, and then use rules such as angles in a triangle add up to 180, angles around a point are 360, or angles on a straight line add up to 180 as well. So I think the easiest way to do this one is by the alternate segment theorem, we know that angle ABC is also going to equal Y. With these type of questions, it's very important to make a note of all the circle theorems you use as a form of reasoning behind all your calculations. We also know that the angle at the center is double the angle at the circumference. So we can say that this angle here is 2y. If we look on the opposite side of the triangle, where angle x is, we can also use the alternate segment theorem for the angle of ACB, and that is going to be x. Now, it's going to get a bit messy within there, so I'm just going to start writing them out here. Next, we know that angle ACO is going to equal x minus a. So the little section in there is going to be x minus a. Now, if you look at that triangle that it forms, so AOC, that's actually an isosceles triangle because AO and OC are both the radius of that circle. So that must mean that CAO is also equal to x minus a. So that means that 2y plus x minus a plus x minus a is equal to 180 because there are 180 degrees in a triangle. So just to make it clear, I'm on about this triangle here, and I'm using these two angles here, the two blue ones, as x minus a. If we add all of those together, we're going to have 2y plus 2x minus 2a equals 180. Divide everything by 2. y plus x minus a equals 90. And rearranging it, we're going to get a equals x plus y minus 90 degrees. And there is our final answer. Now, I know of two other methods, so if you have found these, let me know down below, and well done, because that is a difficult question. Thank you very much for watching, I hope this helped, and good luck in your exams.